guys welcome to my channel um so um the military in niger capital Nema, are calling for the mass recruitment of volunteers to support the army when i say volunteer i mean they are citizens that wants to volunteer um in joining um probably you know um joining the military whether temporarily or permanently just for them to fight off whatever threat that is to come to the country okay so and the reason why they do that is what they are doing that is because of the threat of invasion by the west african regional bloc ECOWAS. the volunteers for the defense of niger campaign spearheaded by a group of nema military aims to recruit ten of ten of thousands of volunteers from across the country to fight in the yeah, to fight in the case of the conflict. Um, well, talking about this, um, this volunteer thing, you know, because they don't have Nigeria does not have um, a, a, a big, a huge number of military personnel to fight for to fight if anything happens. And secondly, the um, terrorists are doing everything possible to even reduce the size of the military the more. Okay, so talking about this thing, I saw this video online. I saw this video of uh, I don't know if you've seen it videos of um, what is it called our youth coppers learning how to shoot I, I saw a picture before I thought it was a joke then I saw a video too then I started wondering are they also working towards uh, it's, it's Nigeria also working towards um, recruiting some volunteers too I mean just look at youth, youth coppers hand being trained by the military talking about Nigeria military something happened yesterday okay um there were some soldiers that were that was um ambushed yesterday in niger in niger state okay so when they were ambushed the um the signal was sent to the nigeria air force and they sent the rescue aircraft okay so the in the news yesterday the media houses orchestrated that the plane crashed you understand but they didn't actually point out the reason what, what really happened so um yeah we have this you know i don't know why they do this anytime they see a news i don't know why they end up trying to manipulate it they don't like to say what happened they don't like to give the full details of what happened i don't know if it was the military that gave them that report but finally some the real truth came out okay so what happened was that there is this guy in niger republic one terrorist like that in niger republic they call him dogo 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 something okay i can't pronounce the second name so um they, they, they these guys are very sophisticated they have anti-aircraft guns they have they have he heavy weaponry that is capable of launching a very serious attack on the nigeria air force even in the barracks even in the military barracks these guys these guys are just something else okay so after after going through that i started wondering i started wondering like you guys should wonder with me if nigeria cannot fight off the internal terrorists the internal problems that we have in nigeria how then do you want to uh, be incorporated into ECOWAS to go to niger and fight don't forget that i know this is guerrilla warfare okay but this guerrilla warfare now you have to understand that their logistic is very difficult because they can be caught and everything will be seized but if you want to fight a full country like Niger, you have to know that they, are, they have the rights to bring in weapons of different of any caliber. They will be supplied by uh, they will be supplied the biggest and the most dangerous ammunitions by Russia or whomever they are doing things with. So you are not even done fighting with these terrorists. You now want to go and fight um, a full country? I don't know, man. You, you guys should just don't even try it. Okay. Oh uh, well, thank you guys. Just subscribe, um, drop your comments, tell me what you feel about the whole thing that is happening. Like and share. I'll bring more updates as things in full unfolds every day. Thank you.